For a beginner in object-oriented uh, programming, a class and an object are very confusing. Here is an explanation of what is a class and an object. A class is a blueprint. It's like a prototype from which objects are created. Whereas an object is the instance that has been created using the class. Let's take a concrete real life example and understand. So in this example, this is a prototype and the prototype says a person can have a name and weight. Those are the two attributes. That's the internal state of the person. What are objects? Objects are real people like Bill who, who is 160 pounds, Sam 150 pounds, Jamie 130 pounds. So those are the objects whereas the the person itself is the blueprint from which the objects are created. So let's go ahead and uh, model this in a class using Java. So I'll go ahead create a class called person. And in our example we had two attributes. One is name. We'll use a string for that. The other one is weight. So these are the two variables. I'll create a constructor to create objects. So the constructor will be same as the name of the class name. It's a special method. To create a constructor, I say person, I pass in string name and int weight. So these are the variables that are parameters that are coming in. I will assign them to the variables. Name equals, uh, we need to say this dot name equals name. This dot weight equals weight. So we'll also go ahead and create a method to print the state of the object. So I'll say print name weight. So this is a simple class here. The class is person as we had discussed in the pro, uh, example and it has two attributes name and weight and we can create the ob uh, create objects out of this class using person uh, constructor and we are printing the values of the variables here so let's go ahead and then test this out using a separate class called person test where we are going to create few objects Let's create a new class, person test, and we need a main method here. I'll select that. This has created. I'll remove the comments which are not helping us out anything here. So I'll create a person called Bill using new operator person. I need to pass the name for my constructor, Bill. 160 pounds and I'll go ahead and then print the values by calling print build dot print so when I run this it prints the name and the method it calls the print method and name and the method so in this if you look at it person is the class bill is the object so we can create any number of objects using a single class. So we have created the prototype, which is prototype or the blueprint, and we are going to create few more objects. So there we go. So we have the blueprint, which is person class, and we have created three objects, Bill, Sam, Jamie. So we can continue to keep creating the as many objects as we want. We'll go ahead and print all of these. We'll run the program now. 
this basically prints the attributes for Bill, Sam, and JB, Jamie. So there you go. So the class is a blueprint. The objects are created using the blueprint. Those are the actual instances.